Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. It's Lexi Kareem. If you didn't know, not yet know. I wanted to show y'all how I do my hey baby. Hey mama. I wanted to show y'all how I do my gallery wall. How I'm doing my gallery wall. I got these custom prints from their 11 by 14. They are from Walmart. I got them from Walmart. I printed them off online. So you can go online and just look up um, custom print, Walmart custom prints, and they'll take you to this website called Photo Something. And you get to put in the picture that you want. Got to subscribe to it, but um, let me see. I didn't realize how loud the TV was. Baby girl, watch how Barbie, yeah Barbie. Yeah, so I got the custom prints from Walmart. They are 11 by 14, the big ones. And then um, the small little pictures I'll be printing out on my own at home. Cause it really don't have to be photos. I'm just printing out on white paper and just put it into the frames. The frames are like glass. What I'm going for is something small. Like I don't want it to be the exact size of the frame like I want it to kind of be smaller but I will print out both like small prints and both like the size of the frame so I can see which one I like better when I get to the suite or whatever and try it out but um yeah I wanted to show y'all how I create these photos in Canva the big pictures I got from Pinterest so whoever shout out to that art that did that you did your thing because the art is really really pretty it's like a girl with braids but I'll show y'all um and the words I just did myself on Canva. Let me show you how I did that. Hey mama sweet girl. So the first print that I got is here. This first picture I created was this picture here. Um, it says scammy and this is just a QR code to my site to book. So people, I just want it to be on the wall. So when they're walking out or they have a guest with them and they're like, oh, okay, I like this style. I want to book as well. They can just scan a QR code and book their next appointment or book an appointment with me. Um, and then the second page, I go to page two, page two. I just created this. It just says braids and it says because personality usually is not the first thing you notice. It's really like a clickbait type of quote like yeah your hair is all of that you know what I'm saying but your personality is all of that as well so I just wanted to have um you know it's just like a little cute little quote um I got that off Pinterest as well it said hair but I changed it to braids so yeah and then this one she got new braids and the game changed i don't like how this looks right here this and some yeah backspace that because i don't like how that looks hmm I'm trying to see how i can why does it look like that Mm. Let me try to. There we go. She got new braids and the game changed. I just love how this aesthetic looks like this little, how it's on there. I put she just entered, got new braids, enter, and the game enter changed. So and I got my logo down here. So what I'm going to do now is go here, share, and I'm going to download this to my laptop. I usually don't do all three because usually when you do that, it doesn't download all three singly. Like it downloads into like a video. I don't like that. So I'm going to just do it one by one. Done. Download. And I just download it as a PNG regular photo. And I'm going to print this out. Uh, if I can find out how to do it. File print. Print. And see, it's like this. Um, so it's like this, but I want it to be like this. So let me try to find out. Yeah. I want it to be landscape. I don't want it to be portrait because... The frames that I'm putting on the wall is like 
vertical it's not going to be up and down horizontally so i'm going to put landscape and then i'm going to press print and it should be printing and while that's printing i'm going to go ahead and save these other two pictures to my laptop just page two dun, dun. And that's the second one. And then I'm going to save this third one. My printer would not print. I ran out of um, ink, so I couldn't really print. And I didn't want to like go through the store, baby girl, and all that. Other stuff. I tried to order the ink online, have it sent to the house, but it, they didn't offer that option for the type of ink that I needed. So I just end up going through FedEx, having them print my pictures for me, and I just pull up and they and I pick them up because um, FedEx is like literally down the street. I'm gonna show y'all what they look like. They came out so pretty. Mm, they have a couple issues with the business cards, but I'll show y'all that as well. But let me show y'all the pictures so y'all can see. This is the business card, and so I got a hundred. I think I got a hundred. Yeah, I got a hundred business cards, and they're on the premium paper, and they're the glossy finish. So as you can see, it's like a glossy finish, and I love the back of the card. It's so pretty, so minimalistic type of vibe is what I was going for. Um, I didn't want much on the card at all. I got my QR code there. Um, and this is how the front looks. So, this is how the front looks, right? It's supposed to have a black border going across the whole card. Like, even on the sides as well. Um, so, I did have some problems with that. It printing out like that. I guess in Canva, I didn't really size the borderline correctly like i think it was it might have been in the cutoff line so it didn't print that part i'm not sure why it's a gap here or a gap here so that is what i was kind of upset about but i don't know my next cards that i print out i will try to do better with that but i'm gonna just have to give these out while you know i have them and then when i run out of these and i'm purchasing more cards i will kind of correct that but other than that i love how the card came out it's super cute um another thing that i would do is i just noticed this i don't know is i will have um I think I will go through Vista Print next time just because I love the I love Vista Print cards better. I feel like they're more sturdier and I feel like it doesn't feel like a piece of paper, like it feels like a card. I feel like this just feels like a piece of paper. But and this is supposed to be one of the thicker cards. Cause I know my last business cards that I had, they were kind of more like thicker and they felt like cards you know versus this it feels like paper i don't know i mean it is paper but i don't know it feels different than my other cards but i think i'm gonna go through beast of print for my next set of cards um but overall they look okay let me know what you guys think in the comments um put these back in here The prints that came out, I think these came out really good. This is the glossy finish as well. She got she got new braids and a game change. So what I'm gonna do is probably have it about this big. I probably won't use this whole piece of paper. I'm gonna cut it to a certain size, and that's what this one says. And then that's what that one says. The skin. So yeah. I probably would go through Vista Print because of their quality of cards. Um, yeah. And also, and I would try to do better when it comes to the trimmings, like 
in Canva, it gives you a border to like make stuff smaller if um, the trimmings is like too large or, you know, so when it comes to cutting, it won't be cut off like this. But um, yeah, it's also see-through as well. So I don't know, it's trial and error. You know, I was just trying to do something new, but I, I will stick with Vista print most definitely. That is what I'm used to. Thank you guys for watching this vlog um, with working with me and creating these business cards and prints for the gallery wall that I will be doing in my next vlog. So stay tuned for my next vlog to see how the gallery wall turns out. If you like this video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and comment down below what you think about these prints or any questions that you have about um, printing business cards or making business cards or prints for your business as well or using Canva or piece of print. Um, um, I like to show you guys anything I like to see. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.